Hey yo, what's up guys? Welcome to C Sharp Basics. Today I'm going to talk to you about tooltip. Some of you know what tooltip is, some of you don't. But for those who don't know what tooltip is, this is the best video for you. What this is, you know when you go with your mouse over some icon and it gives you that little tiny pale cloud where it gives you some sort of an info about the icon. For instance, when you go with your mouse over the icon of my computer, it says, um, I don't know, shows the driver drives drivers and hardware connected to this computer or when you go over recycle bin it'll say recycle bin and so on and so on basically that little info about certain thing now tooltip in window uh, in microsoft visual studio does that it gives you that little tiny info about something which will give you some extra you know push to the customization of your program because let's face it quantity of the program or anything is over quality so pretty much the design is what sells the product but we're gonna use both we're gonna use design and also the quality so this uh, video is about tooltips so let's add a button here come on move, we're gonna move the button here make it a little bit bigger and then we're going to add toolbox. In common controls, third one from below, from down, is tooltip. Double click it and come on, close, man. There you go. It says tooltip one. And you can click anywhere you want and you can type it. So we're going to click on form one. And the uh, form one properties, we're going to scroll down to misc. I believe it's pronounced that way M I S C. But if I'm wrong, please correct me. And here we have tooltip on tooltip one. So here we're gonna write here, this is a test. And we're gonna click on button one and scroll all the way down. See, there's again tooltip on tooltip one. And we're gonna say here info about button. So that's just like a pretty basic things. So we're gonna run the program. So here it is. We'll go over the form one. This is a test, and over button one, info about button. See, it's pretty much basic things, you know, just to get you started from something about graphical interface. Because I'm gonna use, I'm gonna make several videos about it in the future, so you can make one kick-ass program or programs. And when you're gonna give it, to, and when you give them to your friends, they'll be like, "Oh my God, this is amazing! You really..." You really took put an effort in this. You really took your time to put in every single detail in all of this. So yeah, I mean, why not? Even though the code itself is really important, why not have some nice little touch, you know? Just a little tiny details that will say, you know what, this is really good. I see you really worked hard to get this. So this is basically it. It should be like a 10 second, 10 seconds video about open it, add it, write it, run it, works, done. But this is a little bit longer. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, leave a like, subscribe, and also comment if you have any other uh, ideas for programming that you would like to see, and I'll see what I can do. We're going to also try to combine them with the speech recognition, which I'm going to do further uh, right after the graphical interface. So we can finally create some kick-ass programs, and then you can show them to your friends, and they'll see what you do. So. I hope you guys enjoyed it. You stay awesome. You are awesome still. That was a creepy ass sentence. Let me rephrase that. You guys are awesome. And I'll see you guys in the next uh, C Sharp Basics. I right, peace.